and welcome back. This is Jurassic Park Builder Tournament, and I'm the Gaming Beaver. I was just looking at someone who had um, was was playing this game, and he had he had four thousand bucks, and it wasn't that he'd gotten very far on the game. So, like, the only thing I could think of was that I mean, four thousand bucks. He must have spent like two hundred, maybe three hundred dollars on this game, and. Damn! I was just thinking, like, that's a crap, crap load of bugs. But, um, somebody did ask me, how did you get so many coins? I was supposed to start the video here and go, well, here it is. Um, if you have a fan of my series earlier on, you'll know that I had these dinosaurs, and they sort of had a, um, like the flowers. You can get the flowers around them. I thought I'd quickly do this before I started any battles, so don't worry, they are still coming. In case you're like, where's the battles? <laughs> uh, not that any of you beautiful people sound like that. Uh, that's how I sound. So, like, I started with quite low down flowers, then eventually I worked my way to uh, the white tree fern, which gives you 3%, and you can get about 6 or so around one side, so you can see how it can really help out. And then when you've got the money, you you uh you really want to just d do these? It costs seven hundred twenty-six thousand, which is a crap ton. But just to show you how much it pays off, my T-Rex has two hundred and seventy plus percent, and that gives him a total of uh, nine hundred twenty-five thousand coins. Sorry, ninety-two thousand coins. So he almost gives me a hundred thousand in four hours, and again like twenty-four thousand. Even the Raptors give me four thousand. 23,000, 27,000, and these haven't been like fully uh, like weighted. And what I'm what I'm planning on doing actually is filling up this entire row with them, and then uh, moving all these other dinosaurs down. As you can see, I've just kind of thrown everything at the top that because I'm still in the process of uh, like redecorating and just making stuff. I can't sell this because this costs bucks. I mean, it sells for how much? It sells for whoa! Is that it sells for one million, fi almost five hundred thousand. Jesus, how much does it cost? Because it was when it was on offer, and I thought, hey, why not? Let's buy it. It cost eighty bucks, so uh, it must have been forty bucks, and I don't know. I kind of wanted to buy it because it you get like an extra twenty percent, which is a lot more than these give you. The, I tell you what, the biggest ripoff in this game is uh, these volcanoes. Now they give you 25%, but they take up, they take up a lot of space. They do have um, quite a big area on them, but it's ex I think it's exactly the same area as, uh, as one of these guys. And you can place four of them down and get 40%. Uh, so if, if money's not an option to you, and you can just, like it costs 3 million as well. 3 million 500, you can buy four of these for less than that. You'll get four. You'll get like forty percent. So just don't buy the volcanoes. Just just don't do it. What we're gonna do? We're gonna go to the aquatic park because I've I've maxed out the mosasaur. I've maxed out the helicoprion. I've maxed out um. What's the other one we use? Colossal squid. So we have those three golds. They're all maxed out. So now. I I want you to leave in the comments what aquatic creature you'd like to see because. Uh, these guys are always in it, and maybe there's something that you want to see lots of. Like, hey, I want to see, I want to see that weird little, little scorpion or um, that huge ichthyosaur. I want to see that. Uh, um, I would, I would love uh, to just bring in um, this guy, like these fish. But you can see they've only got 440 blood, and the max damage they can do is 338. I think one one of the one of these episodes, sorry, one of these battles, this series, well, this episode, I'm gonna put them in just for like shits and giggles. <laughs> uh, this guy's not too bad, but he's only 900. This guy's maxed, and he's only got 1,600. So, and this one, I've still got 43 hours, and it's been five days. Jesus, like four or five days. But uh, yeah, if you want to see uh, any of these guys. Um, I've got some more up here, hidden away. I've got the Banogamus, the, those Ichthyosaurs. I use them quite a bit, and the Sea Scorpion. But these limited edition uh, DNAs, the Megalodon, uh, 
Protosphere in there? I think that's what it's called. Um, the the Pliosaur. Uh, these guys I see a lot uh, other people using. This guy's good as well, but uh, a Krill's not really... I kind of used all my Krill for my Mosasaur, so... Uh, I kind of want to use the whale a bit more. I want to use the whales! Let's feed the whales! Can we max them out? Oh wow, he's got over 2,000 health. Uh, it's not on par with the uh, the other golds, but he's gonna at least take an, a super, like uh, a special. He's gonna take that. And as long as they can do that, I'm fine with them using them. As long as they can like absorb something. Uh, I'll just check to see. No, I've already, already uh, got those. So yeah, that's how I get coins. Uh, do a farm. Like I've got infirmaries here. They're great, absolutely great. And all like this random junk that's just spotted around. Um, yeah, uh, that's from missions. They just tell you, oh, we need you to get 500 kelp beds. And it's like, seriously? And the reward's like 20 coins. <laughs> 20 coins in one box, so it's not worth it. Um, I was actually gonna uh, get all this XP and see how much, uh, how many levels we'd go up. But, um, we've maxed it out already. The update only gave us five extra levels and we're already maxed out, so... There's, there's literally no point uh, doing that. Those, so I guess when the next update comes out, we get to level 85. Uh, I'll, I'll get all those XPs in the aquatic and the glacier because there's still loads waiting there as well. But you know, leveling up and hatching all those glacier dinosaurs or animals gave me enough XP just to kind of level up to level 80. Especially the missions uh, when you start getting into, I think with the normal park, uh, you unlock a new mission with every level, and that's what I'm up to at the moment, because I've, I've got all the missions. Uh, but with Aquatic and Glacier, they give you so much more experience and so much more re rewards, um, coin-wise. Still, you'll only get one buck if you, uh, if you do it, so I, I don't understand why one buck this game's so freaking stingy with bugs. I have to, like, uh, saying that, this tournament is the best thing that's ever happened. Oh, we got Colossal Squid and Tyrannosaurus today. Awesome. So, uh, yeah, I, if, let's look at the statistics. Oh, 89 victories and that one defeat. One defeat! I've also maxed out Dryosaur. So I only have a Montosaurus to max out. So I'm guessing the max ferocity is probably going to be 15,000. Guessing. So in 15 days, uh, depending on if I get some new creatures... Uh, to show off. That's when I'll do another video um, because we might uh, get shoved back to bronze and I can use the uh, you know the bronze aquatic dinosaurs and you can you can look at those because I really want to see them too. Uh, we're gonna jump in. This game is gonna be the first game that we get lots and lots of uh, bucks from because everything's already had time to uh, to like update so we didn't have to wait for it. Again I don't know if these are bots. I, I really don't know. I noticed something. Uh, you see, he doesn't have a name. You see that? What kind of person doesn't have a name for a start? And you can see my second name there. And yes, thank you for adding me on Facebook. <laughs> uh, and uh, oh, let's let's use our latest uh, Leviathan. Oh God. Oh God. He's not looking in the, the best of shape, is he? Um, if we get a thousand. Uh, yeah, let's just use our squid. We're down on ferocity, but but we'll be okay. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, uh, and most of the people you fight on this, they don't have second names. They'll just be called Terry or Liz or you know something like that. Look, this guy's called Question Mark Question Mark. This ain't Pokemon. This ain't your rival from Gold. Jesus. So that's another thing why I think it might be uh, bots. But if that's the case. Uh, Ludia could be sued for, um, like, fraud, for stealing, uh, not fraud, what am I doing? Oh, ah, oh, we didn't survive, god damn it. Uh, identity theft, that's the one. So we're gonna go for the headbutt, uh, that's fine, we, you know the drill, if they use specials and blocks, we're okay. I think my goal is now to, um, to kind of get up to 4,000 bucks. Now that I saw that person spent hundreds of dollars getting up uh, bucks for this game. 
I'm gonna make it my goal to legitimately get 4,000 bucks. Um, yeah, do you know how long ago these guys uh, were around? The sea scorpions. It was 460 million years ago. Way long before the dinosaurs and their ancestors still around today. You see a scorpion? Not that I would see them in England, but if you see wherever you are, you see a scorpion. Uh, yeah. This little guy gave birth to that one almost 460 million years ago. It's amazing. So, uh, I think I think we're, I think I see scorpions out, and it's gonna be up to a colossal squid. And here he comes, and he eats lobsters for breakfast. So, yeah. Um, another fun fact. I don't know if you know this, but I, well, I'm guessing you do. I think it's quite a common thing to know. But uh, squid have beaks. Uh, octopus and I don't know if octopus have beaks, but I know squids do. They have like a parrot beak at the center of their tentacles to crunch and whatnot. You see, I would say that's quite interesting to, to know, but if you've seen the Pirates of the Caribbean with the Kraken, you probably know. Oh wait, no, that has teeth, doesn't it? It doesn't have a, uh, a beak. That's false! So... Yeah, I think we've won this. I mean, we've got our three blocks, we've got our, uh, our three specials. Sea Scorpion's out of it. The only, the only threat really here is the Megalodon. We don't have to worry about him because he's going out. Uh, I, I thought I might as well block because I don't know how much we can really cope with here. Tail slapping the fish, that's how you do it. Uh, that's probably going to be enough. One more should do it. Uh, you know I'm going to go for another block. And um, go for a tail slap. I was on 200 um, claws last time I did this. And you might, be, you might be wondering, how the hell is he on 700? Well, what you do is you still use the battle arena, but you, uh, for the really low levels like the Triceratops, uh, you get five bucks for completing level one. Sorry, five claws. So do that, and then um, go to level 11 with uh, the Brachiosaur up, and then go to level 18 when you get to the Camarasaurus up, and you should make bucks sorry claws very easily um, and you you can honestly make claws you can make 10 claws a battle when you get to the good ones and since you can do that about six times that's 60 claws that's awesome at this stage I wouldn't mind not having claws because I can just use books <laughs> they're, that, they're just that damn common uh, you bite a shark on the nose isn't that right yes you do and that's it on to the semi-finals Let's do this! Uh, we still have a Helicoprion and a Mosasaur. Shame that Leviathan didn't even stand a chance. Um, you know what I'm going to do? You know, I, I think I've got an idea. Actually. I'm going to use a really low bronze for the final, but I'm going to use the Mosasaur and Helicoprion just so I can still win. Uh, so right now, I'll use the best that I have. Um, I think... Oh, wait. Yes, you know what, I've still got to use one, because uh, these guys can't do anything. So, I'll buy back the Helicoprion. I think that's what I'll do. See, this guy's called Hadrian. Hadrian... nothing. Nobody in this game has second names. No one. Oh, we're going to see Sunburn Fish again. Awesome. It's kind of funny how things come in waves, like... Um, Millions and millions of years ago, uh, reptiles ruled the oceans, and then once they died out, uh, huge fish ruled the oceans, like Megalodon, and uh, prior to that, uh, huge carnivorous fish, like the sunburn fish that we had, it begins with an X, I can't remember its name. Um, and then after that, uh, mammals, huge mammals kind of ruled the oceans. Uh, like whales, you had killer whales, you, you still do, you still have killer whales now. It's quite, I just, I find it fascinating history, and um, something that came to me the other day, I, w I was curious, because the people who play this game on you, like YouTubers that play this game, um, are, uh, we all have one thing in common, we're all English, like that can't be just a coincidence, oh wait no, it's Bite super effective again, damn it, Bite's good against it, come on fishy, yes, you can do it, you can survive, bite it on the nose, Go for it! 
Oh, well. Well, uh, I guess it kind of did some damage, but as long as we, he uses his blocks, we're okay. We're in the clear. Uh, specials I'm not too bothered about because we're going to block, and it doesn't matter what he uses, including the special, and we can still get past it. Hopefully this will be a block. Yep, there we go. We can run through this whole team. But yeah, I think it's an English thing to be really interested in uh, prehistory. Not that I'm saying there aren't other people in the world who are, because if there wasn't, um, that would that would be very strange. Um, but yeah, I always thought that, that, that was just something that it got me. It seems to be a very English thing to be interested in prehistoric life. Come on, Mausaurus. I don't. I think you can survive a bite, can you? Oh, it would have been close. It would have been close. So he still has his specials, but we can kill it with a bite, I think. Do a shimmy sham. Boom! Off he goes onto his helicopter. Uh, I mean, you're fine. You can go for your uh, whatever you want. I think we can survive the special, so I'm gonna want to save my uh, my blocks for later. But coming from someone uh, who's played this game a lot, uh, the tournament, I think I'm more in favour of these guys being bots. Uh, because originally I was like, no, of course they're not bots, don't be silly. And now I'm just thinking like, yeah, yeah, they could very easily be bots. The fact that they don't have second names and uh, sometimes they don't even have names at all. Sometimes I question mark, question mark, question mark. No, oh, I'm going to click it, damn it. Stupid sunburn fish! God damn it! Oh. Okay, yeah, I definitely need to block next time. I can't, I can't afford to throw this away. I want to use a bronze. Uh, do you think we should use like the uh, Dunk Colossus? I want to, but he's gonna go out straight away. Um, you know what? Screw it. Yes, we're gonna use the Dunk Colossus. If we hadn't have blocked here, we would have been out. We would have been out. Again, I'm going to say it. This thing's a sunburned fish or it's a lovely tropical drink. I can see it like next to a pool with ice cubes in it. It's kind of red near the top and then it goes to orange. And then and then the um, the kind of blue bits on it, that, that's the pool in the background. Like you can kind of see the reflection. And that's it. On to the semi-finals. Let's get this bronzer cracking. And uh, yeah, hopefully you'll see something that you haven't seen before. And that's a Dunkleosis getting its ass killed by whatever comes out. It's not like um, it's it's a great one because I've maxed it out. Oh wow, the right side completely lost on that first round. So let's bring him in. He's got 44. <laughs> Dunkleosius. Oh, beautiful. He's going to have a whale of a time. Um, I mean, we'll bring in the Colossal Squid as well. But I just want to show you this. This is this is my present from me to you. Because you, the viewer... You, you, like, uh, if you really enjoy this series, leave a like. Uh, you have no idea how much it helps me out. And I'll keep doing this. And hopefully entertaining you. This was actually a huge armoured fish. Like, we're talking about bone, like, plate. Almost like an exoskeleton. The same as this other guy, actually. Come on, can we go first? You know what? No, I'm saving a block. What? He went for a special. Now, you see, that guy's a dick. He's a dick, because he wanted to kill my Dunkleosis straight away. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to make him use a special. Come on, Dunkleosis. Dunkleosis? Look at him go. Oh, he's got the same special. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm just going to have to follow him off now. Is he oh, he used another special, so actually, maybe I should use bronze more often because they seem to use the specials on them. Oh, poor guy, he only had like 100 health. He got 2,000. Oh, dear. Anyway, on to this guy. We can tail slap it. And, yeah, t basically everything in this game is a two-hit KO. I've never seen something one-hit KO. Except for on my side when I use a bronze. So that, that's probably not even going to do half. No, we can survive another one of that. We've got nothing to fear. Except fear itself. And fear is a sunburnt fish. Oh god, he's still got his blocks? That, I mean, I guess that's fine. I'd like to see if I can run through this whole team with one. 
but I don't think that's possible. I really don't think like a Mosasaur could take three specials. And not even that. There's, there's, it would be highly unlikely if uh, he's used all his blocks and specials. Seriously. All right then. Oh, the colossal squid's gone. Oh, oh Jesus. So, oh, it basically is the Mosasaur against them. But I've won because he has no blocks and no specials. So, uh, yeah, basically. There's nothing they can do. They can't do em enough damage. And this guy has almost 10,000 health. I think it's 9,700? And he does about 3,000. Yeah, 3,031 damage now instead of 2,999. Um, come on, beat the dolphin. Kick Echo's butty. And then we've just got the sea scorpion. And, uh... Actually... Should we see if we can kill a sea scorpion with one special move? I didn't check what uh, what ferocity it was, so we can see. It's kind of nice that um, you don't see their levels anymore. You just see their ferocity, unless you know like all their ferocity levels, or, like what kind of numbers they are. You have no idea what level it is, so maybe that's why they did it. It's kind of like hiding it. So can we get a one hit KO? Oh, come on! Just give it to me once! Just once! God! Never gonna get it! Never! Poor Dunkelosius! Is it, is it Dunkelosius? I thought it was, uh, was Dunkelosius or something. Dunkel Dunkelosius? I don't know. That's what I always called it. Um, it's like you can call this guy a Mosasaur or a Mosasaurus. Um, maybe I'm calling something a Mosasaur. It's like, because there was probably loads of different types of Mosasaur. But he's actually the Mosasaurus. It's like, oh, there's loads of different types of Triceratops, but there's actually only one Triceratops. And there we go, onto 1,400. I don't even know if this, this little yellow bar is getting any more, many more. We are, like, we went from 300 to 2,370, so. Jeez. Um, that's... We'll do, we'll keep going. Uh, I'll probably do three, three battles of video. And at the end, I'll always try to um, add in something that you wouldn't see before, so. Because it, it, you know, it, it makes it more interesting that way. Uh, oh, I want to use my Leviathan this Like, I want him to survive something and to do a hit. I really do. I need to level up these guys as well, especially the Shinosaurus, since he's in his uh, third evolution. Or second evolution, I think it is. Uh, the Lee Zixthes is huge, but it doesn't... I'll, I'll use that next time. Oh god! Yeah, that, w that was a impulse pick. Imp like an impulse buy. Impulse pick! So come on, Leviathan. We can do it. Come on, that's a tiny sea scorpion. You can do it. So around about the time that Leviathan was around, uh, so was Megalodon, and Megalodon uh, probably ate these whales for a uh, for a snack. The advantage that uh, the Leviathan had on Megalodon was that uh, they would, you know, travel in uh, pods, so there was multiple multiple whales there. Oh, he survives! Oh, nice one, Whaley. And yeah, as long as he uses a block, I mean, that's all we want from a meat shield, just to make them use a block. Um, it would be great to evolve him, because then people might not know what uh, level level he's at. But when they've got their like kind of first evolution colorings, like the initial markings, uh, people kind of know that this guy's not a threat, especially if it's something like a Leviathan. If it's a Mosasaur, then it's possible it could still be good. But Leviathan, eh, not so much. Come on, Sea Scorpion. You're much better than that one. Unless it uses a block, in that, which case he's a coward. Coward! You coward! Fight properly! Be a man! Don't use blocks! God! Look, I could have killed you in the last one. I bet you're gonna use a block again, aren't you? Aren't you? Okay, fine, fine. <laughs> Maybe you didn't that time. And I think Fishy's gonna kill us. Fish is gonna kill us? Yeah, fish is gonna kill us. Not as strong as the sea scorpion, actually, though. Let's go for the tail slap. Waste his final block. Yep, just as I 
I don't know if it's like subconsciously I kind of already know what they're gonna go for or if um like I'm just good at predicting I feel like maybe it's just because I fought these PCs so often that maybe I kind of know what they're gonna do I, I have no idea it's possible if they are even PCs because there there is no way to tell yeah He's not going to use any specials until his sailfish comes out. In that case, as soon as that comes out, he will use his special. So now, now the special will be used. And the next turn, he'll also use another special. Whether I'm being amazing with predictions or whether I've just, like, played these PCs too often. Yeah, I'm going to say that they are PCs now. So if anybody's watching, somebody, like, send a fake, like, a bluff saying... You are using real people's images uh, against um, without even asking, and see see if they get back to you like, oh shit! <laughs> Don't sue, we'll pay you millions of dollars. Either that, or we'll see a difference in the game. Cause. No, I don't believe that these are real people anymore. I, I thought I did. I thought I honestly did believe it. See, I predicted that perfectly, cause. Either it, it's the only moves they had, really, or um, they are PCs. The fact that they don't have second names, uh, as soon as you finish the battle, they're ready. It's not like you wait. You're not waiting for, for them to finish their battle. It's like, as soon as you finish yours, they finish theirs as well, surprisingly enough. Uh, and sometimes you battle really quickly, so, you know, somebody could be doing way more, uh, taking way longer turns. For instance, like right now, maybe somebody's still on, they've still got two left on each side. Uh, but look, there's, there's how many battles going on and they all finished at the same time. I don't believe it. And does Tina have a second name? Tina doesn't have a second name. So I have no idea. Uh, I'm going to save, I want to save the Mosasaur and Colossal Squid. Uh, we'll use these two. And, um, we'll, we'll use the Helicoprion again. Oh god, they're still... Oh, stop boosting! Damn it! Um, yeah, I'll use another bronze uh, for the, for the, um, for the final. And <laughs> see how long they last. I kind of want to use something I haven't seen before, but has a chance. Um, I think I've only maxed out two of the bronzes, and that's the uh, Duskalosis, Duskalosis, or whatever, and the uh, Ammonite. The Ammonite. Um, what's good against a turtle? Your head, buddy. You smack it with the head. Uh, leave a comment saying if you've tried smacking a turtle in the head. No. <laughs> I just realised what that sounded like. No, I mean, leave a comment if you've uh, if you've tried like smashing your head into a turtle's shell. Not just like smashing a turtle over that. Jesus, don't do that. Seriously, don't do that. That's like, that's terrible. If you do that, you're a terrible person. Uh, God, aren't like aren't turtles endangered now? I, I can't speak for all of them. I'm sure there's a turtle called like common something or other turtle, but uh, leatherbacks are absolutely huge. Like leatherback turtles are. I think they're bigger than six foot. Like, uh, length anyway. Like, huge turtles. Come on. Come on, Mawasaurus, you can do it. If only I fed this guy. If, like, because I've seen uh, other people or bots use this creature before, and when it's fully evolved, it's really good. I think that's because it's one of the last creatures you uh, unlock with, um,. With coins, is it? You don't have to get a rare DNA, is what I'm saying. You just have to get a normal DNA. I can't even remember how you unlock normal DNA now. You still do searches? I can't remember. Yep, out this one goes. In comes a helicopter. I'd love to see how it used that jaw, like, to catch fish. Whether it kind of, like, unwrapped and it curled round the, uh, the fish. Or, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how it would use it. Maybe it was like a, like an actual chainsaw. And it just kind of like rotated teeth really fast. 
No, that's that's impossible. I'm, I'm, unless I don't know, maybe it did. So use your last special, and then I'm I'm home free. So let's go for the tail slap. Oh, uh, yeah. If you go for another special, I can survive this. Yeah, I know I can survive it. At least, at least I think I can survive it. Right? It's it's a fully leveled out helicopter. There's no way I wouldn't be able to survive it. Right? Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, yes, we do survive it. Here at the Game and Beaver, we do like to make matches as intense as possible. So onto the Dacosaurus, and he, yeah, we definitely have to block here because it looks like it's a fully evolved one. It's got its highlights round its colours. And we could probably finish it with two specials. Because nothing in this game gets finished off with one. I was I was watching some other some other YouTubers. Oh god! <laughs> some other YouTubers and um, that play this. And their screen seems really small. I don't know. I don't know if it's because they play it on a PC or maybe not on Google Chrome. But yeah, like this is quite large in comparison to theirs. Because they get a lot of this like black background. And it's quite zoomed in. But like shrunk their little screen, so. I wonder if it's just if you use it on Internet Explorer, heavens forbid somebody still uses that thing. Or um Mot uh, Firefox or Safari? I don't know, but all I know is that we're fighting Patricia, who does not have a second name. God, there's a lot of people out there who don't. And we're gonna use a we're gonna use a bronze. What do you wanna use? Uh, who, who, I haven't seen the Ammonite. I want to see the Ammonite. What does it look like? We'll use the Colossal Squid and Mosasaurus, so. And I, Eve, I'm gonna block, and then I'm gonna use my special on the Ammonite, because I want to see what it looks like. I, I'm, unless it spins like a turtle. I can imagine it spinning like, like a turtle, but that would have been incredibly lazy. Surely there must be something. <gasps> Maybe it's like the Colossal Squid. Maybe it sprays ink. I don't know if Armonite actually spraying. Oh, look at them! Look at the, those beautiful blue markings around their shell. That's really nice. I'd love to use this guy more often. So let's see what the special is. Ooh! Oh, it's a bitch slap, and it does 842. Yeah, I'm sorry, Armonite. I've, I've got to let you go. I'm, I'm really sorry. <laughs> no! Oh, it didn't even fall down. It just kind of like turned around and went. Aww. <laughs> oh, that's a shame. Okay, let's bring in the colossal squid to fight for its lo its lost cousin. Come on, for the ammonite. Oh, this person hasn't went for any blocks yet, and we've went for a block and a special. But because we've got the mosasaur and because we've got the colossal squid. I honestly don't think there's any way we can lose. What's he gonna do? He's gonna yeah. They all know their weaknesses, but then again, uh, for argument's sake, I know uh, all of these guys' weaknesses anyway. So I have seen on uh, some Facebook groups that people have said, "Oh well, it's I think they're computers because they know my what's good against what like straight away and never make a mistake." But um. Uh, so do I. I know, I know what's uh, good against what. I mean, when I started, I didn't. But since I've played this for hours and hours and hours, as you can tell by how many books I've got, um, yeah, it, it's kind of you kind of get used to it. Like it's sort of like um, you know how you remember things. Like you take a mental trip around your house, and that's how you remember lists very easily. It's kind of like, oh, fish, slap. You slap with a fish, raw fish, slap, you, that's it, tail slap the fish. Um, and the same with, like, the Megalodon. You bite shark, bites hard, use a bite on the shark. Well, a shark has a very dangerous bite, rather than anything. So that's how I, I remember these guys. And again, I know bite's good against him because I've, I've kind of made the mental association with you have to bite through its neck. Uh, to kill it, so maybe maybe that's why I don't know. But you you are right; it is possible that they are bots for that reason. Well, that reason, and loads of other reasons. So, oh, this guy's going for the all-out specials on me. Um, 
I don't know whether to be worried. It didn't seem like it did too much damage. We're probably just over 50%. Uh, sorry, under 50% for hell. So, um... That's fine, they can use another special and uh, yeah, we're fine. So this just shows if somebody uses all their blocks and then all their specials, uh, well, um, what is it, Elasmosaurus? Well anyway, that this thing can't take out a, uh, a Mosasaurus. No, doesn't stand a chance. And now you're gonna see how much damage one of my specials does. So that was three of its and then one of mine. Let's just see the damage difference, shall we? I think I was very lucky. I only um, leveled up the Mosasaur because there was nothing in my park that would eat krill. So I just fed it all to the Mosasaur, not thinking that um, it was going to be a, like one of the best for the aquatic, because I'm guessing it is. Um, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I, I think it is. So there we go, at least we got the Omni into the final, and I'm, I'm kind of pleased with that. Because nobody else is going to use that Omanyte at all in the All-Star League. So even if they are people, real people, they'll be like, Jesus, this guy used an Omanyte and that's like, I got a, I got praise to him. That's awesome. <laughs> so that's going to take us to 1,485. I think actually um, I didn't make any profit on books there because I uh, bought back the, uh, the Colossal Squid twice. I'm not too sure. Um, we'll do one more. To end this video, um, we have to remember 1,485, I think that's what we got. Right. Uh, we have to buy back all these, that's 2, 4, 6, probably 80, uh, 100. You know what? Let's use the lead Zikthes. No, no, I'll save the lead Zikthes for the for the final. Uh, let's buy. You know what? We haven't used this guy yet. Ah, quickly! <laughs> I hate that. I hate that noise. Running out of time. It's absolutely horrible. I kind of want to use um my books to buy food for my creatures. Um. But at the same time, it's like a ripoff, unless I use 500 bucks to buy half a million fish or half a million krill. And then we probably could level up, um, like something completely. Uh, is it, is it tail slap that's good against this? Yes, yes it is. Unfortunately, we're not doing too much damage. Um, oh, that's gonna go for it special. That's not gonna kill us, so... In a way, it's kind of wasted, because he probably could have went for two normals and killed us. Yeah, I think think that's a possibility. Uh, I'm going to go for that tail slap. In one of the lost episodes, this fish did kill it. You know what? We're going to do it. We're going to have this fish kill the Trina. Just for old time's sake. Come on, fishy. You could do it. Slap it. Oh, come on. You know what? I'm going to... Use oh god. Oh. Oh what the hell just happened? Did did it like go oh no, how dare you use a block? Did I just crash the thing? Hello and welcome back! Yep, guess what? We lost 30 bucks and we lost lots of other bucks because the freaking game disconnected us, so we're probably not gonna make um our money back with this one. But we're gonna get something, so we might as well, like, keep on going. Um, I didn't use anything that was too taxing. I only used the Helicoprion, and then I used these guys. So, I'm, I mean, I'm gonna buy them back, because they're, they're great meat shields. Um, Dacosaurus is gonna be first up. Uh, let's use a dolphin. Let's use dolphin -y. And So, as you can see... Uh, will with one L. Is that even a spelling of Will? I have no idea. Uh, but again, no second name. Which is great. Uh, you can check out other YouTubers. I think I'll do it just to research whether their second name appears or whether it's just me. 
Um, but not once have I seen somebody with a second name. So that could be a reason why they're all bots. And, uh, but I don't, I honestly don't know why, why the game would, you know, do something like that. Why Ludi would risk a lawsuit just to, to uh, use people's pictures. But again, if you were to, like, sue them, uh, you'd have to have some proof. They would have to, like, use your profile picture, or you'd have to have proof that, you know, somebody who was real, they had used theirs their profile picture. So, I mean, you could type in Will and look for a, look for a motorbike dude, but chances are you're not going to find them. And I think that's maybe what they're, they're counting on. Lawsuit against Lily. I'm joking. I love, I love this game and I wouldn't do anything to stop it from, from going. Even if that means shutting up. <laughs> oh, this person still hasn't used a single block or a special. Um, Probably waiting for uh, to use it on their sunburnt fishy. I don't know whether I've seen a maxed out sunburnt fish or not. I think this one might be. I can see a little bit of highlight on him. So let's go over the tail slap. Is it is it a maxed out one? I don't know. I'm just trying to look at the blue. But I mean, I can see all a sort of highlight on him, and maybe he is maxed out because he's got the extra sunburn on the eyes. <laughs> So finally this person is going for the blocks. And are they going for the specials? No, they're not going for the specials. They will do this next turn because they know that they're gonna have to in order to kill my helicopter. And if they do that, that's fine. They can go for the special now. No. Right, okay, we now need to block because a special from this guy is gonna kill us. So we'll keep using Tail Slap, wasting his blocks. Yep, just like that. And we're, we would be in big, big trouble. I think we are actually in big, big trouble. <laughs> yeah, I think we are in big trouble. Um, because we can only block once more. And then we've got the turtle. Oh god, are we going to lose? Like... Oh god! I think we've lost, guys. I think we've lost. Yeah, we've lost. God damn it. Yeah, yeah, there is no way that we're killing this this fish now. No way. Um, I'm just gonna have to go for a headbutt. God damn it. No, Sharky! <laughs> no! Um, oh, you know what it is? It's because I didn't save. I think I blocked at some point. I didn't stick to the tactic and I'm getting sloppy. I'm really getting sloppy. So we're gonna do it one more time and I'm not gonna get sloppy because at the moment, we're actually losing bucks to uh, these computers, so that's not good. Mel, with no second name, again. Uh, we're gonna. Try oh my god! Look at look at all this. We're having to buy back. Yeah, it's, we're probably. I never lost when I used uh, when I used Benogamus, Mawasaurus, and then something else. Never lost. Never. So as long as it's always Benogamus, Mawasaurus, and Helicoprion will be okay. And then I can use um, the dolphin, the ichthyosaur, the sea scorpion, and the helicopterian. And then I can use a bronze, and the colossal squid, and most And that'll, that should wrap it up. So sunburn fish caused me so many problems. So many. Look at it. Look at it with burnt eyes, Jesus. That's what happens when you look at the sun for too long. Right, we're gonna survive another one. I don't think we can survive a special from it. Actually, I seem to remember this profile picture of this person. Um, damn, I should really just go through all my videos and see if, like, it is the same person with the same name, or whether they just took the profile picture and put a different name underneath. 
Oh, a binog Oh, he survives! Oh, a little fishy, go! Come on! Oh, yes! Come on, fishy! I'm not going to waste a block because last time I did that, we lost and we could have won. Very, very easily. Uh, but I had to use a safe play. I had to block. Just like they're doing. <laughs> yeah, if... If we'd survived in the previous round where we fought the fish, this this exact fish actually, uh, if I hadn't blocked and I took the bite, we'd had a tiny slither of health. Then we could have used a special against a turtle, blocked his special, and then used a headbutt and won. But honestly, if the fish had decided to go for a special, we would have lost. So, you know, what are you gonna do? So we still have our three blocks and three specials intact. Thank God, when we have lost, we've only lost during the uh, during the first initial like qualifying stage, and not losing like at the semi-final or final because then we would have used so many bucks. Oh God, what's he gonna go for? Oh wow, yeah, but that's his last special, so uh, we we don't really have anything to worry about unless they block. Um, Tail Slap's good against Helicoprion. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. As long as we use... we Actually, we can survive whatever this, this can dish out. So as long as we survive that... Um, even if they use that block now... Yeah, we've, we've won no matter what here. Yeah, even if they did that block. But we have to block every time now. Because we couldn't survive that Tail Slap. I'm pretty sure we can't survive a tail slap from a Megalodon. Um, we can kill it with a tail slap. And then out comes a Megalodon. Oh, it's a, it is a fully evolved Megalodon as well. You can tell because it's got the light blue highlights around its dark spots. And off we go. Jumping out of the water. Using the momentum and straight at him and doing... Oh. You know, never. It'll never happen. It's, ne it's never one hit KO. Ever. It's always two. So this... Yeah, that guy is such a, like, a fast tail slap. I, I don't know whether I would... I'd be worried being bitten by him or hit by him. Um, so we're going to have to go for the bite. And that's it. He's out of there. Yeah, I, was, I watched um, some sort of program and they were saying that... If a grow white shark, because they can swim really fast, if you were in the water and he was to like swim at you and hit you head first, um, it would be the equivalent equivalent of being hit by a bus. Because, um, I mean, not that it's as heavy as a bus, but it's the fact that it's got, um, oh, what is it? it? It has, you know, water resistance that uh, comes up from behind. Like, uh, so, if you, when you get hit by something and you move really fast through the water, it, it's like it almost creates a barrier. So, you start moving as fast away from it, and that means that, like, there's more force, and... Oh, it was really fascinating. It's like uh, that fact that you can run... If you've had a pool of water, uh, and you try running across it, you're gonna go straight down. You're gonna go straight under. But if you fill that same swimming pool, with custard, uh, that you can run straight across it. Straight across it. Uh, if you stayed still, you'd sink into it. But because um, it's all about its consistency and the fact that if you hit it really hard, uh, the molecules don't have enough time to uh, get away from each other, so they almost form like a brick wall. Oh, he's gonna go for his special. I don't mind that. I know my fishy can survive it. And he does. Beautiful. Go for another tail slap. Uh, make them waste waste their uh, blocks. If that's the case, they can use another special and finish me off. But I don't think it's gonna. Oh, it did. Damn it, fishy. You had one job. <laughs> one job. Okay, that's fine. You can you can use your blocks, uh, Yukino. I think I hope I'm saying that name right. If you are a bot, then uh, yeah. If I do face um one of you guys that are, that are watching if you say oh i did face you and this is legit please like leave a comment saying that because i have no idea if this is real or not um yeah we're only using our sea scorpion to fodder and it, it's worked great because 
They only have one block, one special, and we've got all of ours. Unfortunately, this helicopter is um, doing a lot of damage to us. Unfortunately, uh, we are down to our last one. But they, they've only got two left. Their sunburn fish does come out. Uh, we can survive if it uses a special, and it does. Uh, so that's fine. Uh, is this the semi-final? I'm getting lost. I think it is the semi-final because I want to use a bronze. Uh, just to show you guys because um, if you were to watch this, it could get boring. Uh, very easily because I'm using the same sort of things over and over. So in the final, it's, you know, it's, it's nice showing you something. Right. Uh, we can't survive anymore. And the fact is they've still got their block. Oh, no they don't, so now we can use our blocks and specials. And that's it, assured victory, onto the final and using a bronze. Uh, what should I use? Like, as a bronze? I kind of want to use the lead zip piece, because it's so big. But, um, I don't know, I've used it once before. I don't know whether that was in one of the lost episodes, but I have used him once before. But, I mean, it could be possible he was in one of the lost episodes, so I'll use him again, and, and we'll, so we'll see how long he can survive for. I do want to use a special. It's always nice to see what they, they can do, because I could easily switch it in, and it could be KO'd in one hit. So, um, unless we go first, then I won't need to use a block. And at least then we get to see it special. So there we go, into the final, take that Archelon, and... Uh, yeah, this one should really be just showcasing Helicoprion because I think I've used him so much in this episode. Yes, I think I'm going to use the lead deck piece. I think I am. So there we go. Against Libya. It sounds very close to Ludia. And guess what? They don't have a second name. So, oh wow, it takes half an hour for this to get back. I think the Triceratops takes about quarter of an hour. Uh, so let's use that lead zip these um, because it's a very strange uh, like body type so they will have to do a separate animation for it. Um, almost 3000 ferocity. It's the same with the Armonite because I was thinking you know when they have the chance to use the same rig and the same skeleton on one model they can just use the same animation so that's why the Mosasaur has the same uh, same animation as the Pliosaur, because it is the same model, uh, same rig, sorry. Uh, so we're gonna have to use a block here. Oh, well it wasn't wasted, if anything. Um, so these Le Leedzichthys were huge and they fed on plankton. They were almost like whales, but I think probably the biggest fish to ever live. Uh, let's use it special and see what it looks like. Oh, what's it gonna do? Oh, oh my god, coming out the water! And this is like a body slam? Jesus! Oh, and it did a lot of damage! Oh wow, that's amazing! I'm so glad I got to see that. Oh, and he survives! Come on, Lee Zixis, you can do this! You can do this! Tail slap that mother! Oh, oh, well, it was worth a shot. He's not gonna survive, or she's not gonna survive. And she sinks like the Titanic, but that was amazing! Like, I'm so, I'm so happy I put that in now. Because you, you, you rarely get an opportunity to really showcase these creatures. And the fact that it didn't block, you got to see how much damage it did. We could have been here for hours and hours and just trying it over and over. Never working. But it was meant to be today. Really meant to be. And out comes his um, uh, costume. Well, he's got exactly the same dress. <laughs> this colossal squid. Uh, using the same red and uh, blue spots. I don't mind it. I'm digging I'm digging the spotted uh, polka dot bug. Uh, and that's it, no more blocks, so this Ophalmosaurus is gonna gonna go out. I wonder if you guys are noticing that I say air a lot. Like uh, <laughs> and like, I always do that. I hate when people do it. There was so I was I mean I recently finished to uh the Breaking Bad series, and my god, so beautiful. I, lo I loved it. Um, I got up to the last series, and I, I was putting it off for ages because I didn't want to finish it. But, um, and I, you know, I didn't have the hype. I wasn't there when it was new, and it was 
oh, what's going to happen this week? Because it's we have to wait a week, and when it's on, gotta watch it. So I, I can kind of watch it in my le my, my leisure. Um, but, oh, amazing series! I loved it. I was gonna say something about it. I've completely forgotten. I have no idea. So Cisco being last, that's uh, that's rather strange. But that's fine. You can do it. Users dig. Um, it's possible that sea scorpions could have uh, dug under the sand and lay in wait, waiting for some sort of unsuspecting uh, uh, ancestor of the fish to come along, or even, you know, a smaller sea scorpion and kill it. So it's possible, really possible that they could have done that. So we're going to use our special, are we going to kill it in one hit? Oh, come on, it's always just like the tiniest, it's always just Frickin' smallest bit. Um, I don't think we were on 1,400, were we? But we we had a disconnection, so we have used uh, we have used more bucks than we should have. So I don't think we're gonna get back to 1,400 bucks. But the next the next few battles we will. We'll probably get to 1,800 maybe, and yeah. So if you do this and you have like a, a Mosasaur and you have some meat shields, you could literally just go through it, get them back, do it again. Go through it, get them back, do it again. And make more bucks every time. So we are actually on to 1,400. So uh, yeah, that's going to end up this episode here. Uh, leave a like if you really enjoyed this series. I've enjoyed making it and being your host. And thank you for all the comments. I love reading them and getting, getting back in touch with you. So uh, until next time, bye bye